What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Dalen Spratt, one-third of the infamous Ghost Hunting Trio, the Ghost Brothers, and I have my beautiful wife with me today. Hello. What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Stacey Lee Spratt, half of this one. I like it. I like it. People be like, didn't y'all wear that the last video? I Maybe know, we I did. Asked you, we should, I told you we should change. But why, guys? We're shooting them back to back to back. We're compiling content so we can always have it for you. We should have changed, y'all. Let us know. So we'll so. change a little bit next time. <laughs> next time we'll do it differently. So this is a continuation of the last video, guys. And we know how we felt about that one. Yes. So let's see what Brandon has in store with the remain. My teeth look really good today. They do. They That's because I upgraded our camera to 1080p. Oh, you upgraded us. I did, babe. You know, I'm going to upgrade you, baby. Mm, okay. You know, when you got with a ghost brother, you know, I took your life from here to here. Okay, let's not do that. Okay, my bad. Yeah. Let me get it back. Let me get it back. Get back to the game. <laughs> here we go. Basement dweller. This already sounds stupid. What you think? <laughs> <laughs> That's not good. I'm already setting you the bar low. You already setting the bar low. The bar is low for everyone that's viewing. Yep. Let's see. Let's that's see. all right. We keep it trill on this channel. Basement dweller. The next video comes from the TikTok user AK47. The owner of the account is a woman who lives alone with her children. As such, she has decided to make the necessary preparations to ensure their safety at home by setting up multiple security cameras around the house and outside the premises in the event that anything were to happen. However, she received a motion detection alert one night from one of her cameras pointing towards the basement. When she checked the footage, she was shocked. Watch closely. As you can see, something creepy emerges from the basement and makes its way upstairs. Viewers then requested that she move the camera towards the stairs to get a better angle and see what she captures. And it doesn't take very long for the camera to capture something else. Wait, what was that? That was, oh, that was Stacy. That that was a whole person. That was a whole shadow. It was fast. It, would that be a shadow figure? Mm, let me look again. Yeah, because it was white. It was almost oh, like it a. It was white. It was almost like a. As you can see, something creepy emerges from the basement and makes its way upstairs. Viewers then requested that she move the camera towards the stairs to get a better angle and see what she captures. And it doesn't take very long for the camera to capture something else. That's an apparition. That's an apparition. It was just too bad. So what's an apparition? So an apparition. Apparition is kind of like a, what people would call a ghost. Okay. That you kind of see, you see them, it's kind of translucent. Got what it. people would think of when they say ghost. When you think of, a, yes, why you think of clear. Or just a person that you, you know what I'm saying, the manifestation of a person. Got it. Okay. A shadow figure is more so a shadow. Yeah, a shadow of a figure. Right. Yes. Right. Okay. Apparition. Right. But is apparition is more so like, this is, I feel like it's more of like a manifestation of an actual spirit. Okay. Right? That's what that looked like. Right. But there's other words. It's like spectral spec. I'm gonna need you to, I need to be more educated in your in your ghosting. Listen, I learned if you ask me about event planning, I'm gonna be able to I know all the words and things. Give so, me a word about event planning that I don't know. That you think maybe I'm not a know. word, but like, okay, how many bartenders should you have? 
in terms of the number of people that you have at a party? Like if you have a hundred people at a party, how many bartenders should you have? A hundred people? Mm -hmm. Eight. You would waste your client's money. How many I'm supposed to have? Usually you have a bartender every 50 people. Every 50 so to have, 70 people. So have one and a half bartenders. <laughs> <laughs> a man and a baby bartender. <laughs> Got you. Back to Ghost of the Roaster, guys. We apologize for taking y'all down that rabbit hole. <laughs> I need you to up your uh, ghosting verbiage. Yeah. I want to, can I, how do I catch it? Huh. Right, right. <laughs> it's like that video game you got to play at the arcade when you try to hit it where the light yes. goes. We okay. wouldn't have won. <laughs> Shit. Oh. Okay. Ah, I missed it. That's all right. Something creepy quickly zooms across the narrow pathway at the bottom of the basement stairs. Oh. And whatever it was, it was so fast that the footage had to be slowed down substantially just for us to catch a glimpse. Wow. Now, after a few more nights of peace, she receives a motion detection alert. And this. I was tripping. I said, I know that ghost is not wearing Chuck Taylors. Babe, no. That's the person. That's <laughs> that a person. Is a person. That's this time, a person. her jaw would drop at the sight. <laughs> oh, oh, shit! What's that? Oh, uh-uh. No. What looks like a full face manifests within the basement no. and looks to be making its way upstairs. Each time it seems to manifest more and more clearly, as we can see the bright glowing eyes as it moves around. She was then asked if she had any creepy collectible items in the basement, and that's when she responded with this. These. They are... Mirrors. Antique mirrors, See? portals to hell. See? I know what a portal See? to hell is. I do too. Are legit antiques. A friend of mine will not come in my basement because he says it's creepy to have antique um, mirrors. And they are heavy. I also have the clock. I refurbished this clock. It is a real antique. It works, <clears throat> excuse me. But my kids say that the chime is really creepy so they never want me to turn it on. So just who? Like I'm not the one to victim shame, but it's like <laughs> you got all that stuff in your house. It's like you. Why would you get? I mean, for your kids to say it's creepy, for your friend to say these antique mirrors are not a good idea. Why would you keep that in the basement? Stacy, this might. Be or what exactly is this basement dweller that seems to be making multiple appearances within this basement? And could these antique items possibly be responsible somehow? Let me. And you said this was not going to be a good one, Brandon. This is a. This is. This is. This is ghosted. It, it's definitely ghosted. And Brandon, I want to say I apologize for every negative thing yeah. I ever said about you behind your back. <laughs> I said a lot. He's talked a lot of shit. Oh, about you. Brandon, I to be honest. I talked about your mama. I wouldn't be surprised if you don't quit. I talked about your dog. <laughs> the girlfriend you dated back in 86. Everybody was getting called out their name, Brandon. But this was a good one. This, this was great. Is, bro. is it over? Is it done? That one, that one's done. That was a good one. That was a good one. That was ghosted. That was Definitely. a good ghosted one. That was a good ghosted one. I would have been scary. terrified. She was too calm for her, like you said, for her family being there, and you see like a basement dweller. That thing looked demonic. It did look that when those eyes popped out, that looked that did not look like Casper the friendly ghost. Mm. Mm. That looked evil. So we saw an apparition. It was just moving very, very fast. Very fast. And the speed of it is what concerns me. Because it's just like only evil people move that fast. They had to slow the video down. That wasn't even, it was fast in that video and they slowed it down for us. Will we immediately move? Immediately. 
and we would leave all that. I thought you about to say we would leave Axel. <laughs> Are you <laughs> crazy? Leave our baby? No. <laughs> we would leave all that antique stuff behind. I wouldn't even want to sell it to anyone. I wouldn't want anyone to 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 gain a ghost. You just you're so sweet. I would have been like, right. garage sale, $10, vintage see, mirror. See, no. <laughs> I would trash it. I would, tra I would trash all of it. That's a good one, babe. Proud of you. Ghosted. Ghosted. Spread family. Peace.